We can be homeless. We can be broke. Okay, we got another Zamboni karaoke. Chaska, we got Mike Coster, Justin, Mike Caster. Look at my handwriting, by the way. Yeah. I mean, what is that even? That's I'm going to be a doctor. Mike Caster, Justin Bach, and Blaine Warner. Perfect and easy. Did that perfect. Nailed it. There's Chaska. There's Chan. Chaska Chan. I don't get it. It's so confusing. It's like there's two brothers, but then they grew up together, and then their parents got divorced. Like what? How does it work? It's like when there's two twin girls, and one of them's cute, and the other one's ugly, but they're the ugly sister. Oh Jesus! Does uh, does Chaska have a dinner theater? No, <laughs> I don't think no, so. No. no, Chan does, so that explains it. Well, and and they're the ugly sister. Yeah. We'll see. Can you pretend that airplanes in the night sky like shooting stars? I can really use a wish right now, wish right now, wish right now. I want to make an announcement for the first time in the history of Zamboni karaoke. We have a goalie. So I don't know what that means. I don't know. Maybe goalies, you're like a goalie, and people feel comfortable bringing you out in public. <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, you know, goalies are just generally a special breed. You're not really saying it. Goalies are just weird. Yeah, they're yeah, they're bizarre. Are you are you? Do you live up to the goalie weirdness factor? He's got like three or four racquetballs that he's playing with four games. Like just the weirdest things I've ever seen. Like not like regular goalie drills. It's like. Like juggling or something? Yeah, it's juggling and like going between his legs and throwing him at his, the balls at his teammates. So you throw the racquetballs at other people that get ready as a goalie? Correct. Sing us a song, the piano man. Sing us a song tonight. Anything, if you had to have more of a bumper sticker on your Instagram, what would you go with? Letter, letter, buck. letter yeah, buck. Letter I think buck, I think, would be mine. Letter buck. Um, I don't know if that seems like maybe we can't say that. I don't know what it means. What's what's the best hockey parent thing you saw growing up? I was taking a nap in the car before the game, and he told me we were on the freeway, and he told me the trunk was open, and he told me to go shut it. And so I walked out there, and he floored it on the freeway and left me standing there. Your dad's amazing. Is he like Chuck Norris, or what kind of father do you have here? Yeah, honestly, yeah, honestly he's just like Chuck Norris. Does he have a mustache? No. No. He should grow a mustache. I don't know about you, but I'm feeling 22. Everything will be alright and I'll be here next to you. I don't know if people say stuff to the goalie or what, but what are some of the best you've heard uh, out on the ice um, recently? Uh, I've had dudes ask me if I have sunburn on the back of my neck from the goal lamp behind me. So that one, that one hits home a little bit. That's a thinker, yeah. right? So who are the biggest beauties on your team? I'd say Billy Bronson. Like sometimes before games, I just get so off focus, just mesmerized by his hair. And it's so long, like I felt it on my neck sometimes. Thanks for inviting him. Would I like to see him? Sweet Caroline, ba, ba, ba. Good times never fit so good. So good, so good. So good. If you had to tell someone why to come to Chaska, they're like a tourist. They're coming to town, they're bringing their family there, they got a map of Chaska tucked in their belt. Uh, we have a really nice quick trip. Have you ever been to the Chaska Par 30? <laughs> <laughs> Not a big deal. Also known as the Dirty 30. The Dirty 30. The Dirty 30. Alright, um, I'm going to have to go comments off I think for this one. <laughs>